Hi, so I'm demoing this piece of software here called Remote Spark, and what you see here is um, I'm in a browser and I'm doing a remote desktop, except it's not using the R RDP protocol, it's using HTML on a uh, HTML5 canvas. And here it's called Remote Spark, and this is the website. And you'll notice the speed here, and again, it's totally within the browser, so here you, you see I have a remote desktop session and again it's not using RDP and it's not using any of the RDP ports uh, 3389 it's purely HTML using only port 80 and web sockets and HTML5 um, and you'll see that the response time is very good so I'm gonna bring up paint here and you'll see the response time is awesome and I'm gonna do some typing and you'll see the typing is pretty much real time. I don't see, I don't feel a lag. Um, and let me log out of this. So I'm gonna close my browser tab here. And this is how I log in. This is the default page after you do the installation. And I'm gonna do another video on the installation itself. Uh, but here in this specific video, I'm gonna demo just the features. So I'm gonna click connect here. So, so what this is, is it's a gateway, meaning you connect to this computer that you install the software on, or server that you, that you install the software on, uh, as a gateway to other computers. So this is a gateway to RDP. So I've, I've put in my remote desktop, and I'm running it on 443. So this totally bypasses any of the firewalls uh, that might be blocking uh, certain ports. And, and even advanced firewalls that might actually be blocking a port based on the protocol. So uh, you might be able to mask a uh, the RDP protocol by putting it on 443, but some firewalls will still block that because it will detect that traffic is not actually HTML or, or is not actually HTTPS. Uh, so here, uh, I'm just putting in username, password, domain, and I'm gonna click connect and again uh, in another video I'll show you the uh, installation process for setting up this gateway and what this gateway does so it's trying to log in now so it's going through the gateway connecting through uh, pure HTML uh, across HTML5 the uh, H using the HTML5 canvas and web sockets and you'll see it's logged in now so I'm logged in and it's just the normal RDP session, except again, it's not using the RDP port 3389, but pure uh, HTML or pure port 80 or port 443 if you choose to uh, actually uh, go through that. So um, check out my other video of uh, my installation and the product is called Remote Spark, the HTML solution, and you could download a trial here. Uh, and download Spark View for Windows. And uh, once again, I am I'm actually not affiliated with this company. Um, I was just trying to find a RDP client that can bypass basically bypass firewalls and do pure uh, pure HTML, uh, which lots of firewalls allow without doing the RDP and it took me a long time to find something that was pure HTML using HTML5 so um, again uh, check out my other video on um, the installation process and thank you for watching